Hi there, I'm Reed, and this is Ryan, this is Reed and Ryan's Reviews, and today we have uh, built an Estes model rocket, the Baby Bertha, and this is our first rocket that we have built, and we came up with some uh, few changes and paint scheme, and ran into a couple problems along the way, and Ryan you can put the stuffing in. Uh, when we bought the model, it's our first one, and we didn't really know what all to buy. So we missed out on the launch pad. We had the launch stick, but it did not come with actual pad, tripod that you put together. So we built one out of this piece of wood and drilled a hole in there. And we're using this as a good alternative, hopefully, to our launch pad. And we're gonna go out and launch this rocket. We have low winds today, don't we? Yes. Where are the winds at? Seven miles, eight miles per hour winds. That's not too bad. And we have a large field near our house, and we're going to hopefully be able to recover the rocket, our first launch, the baby Bertha from Estes. You have it all in there? Yes. All when, right. When we put this down, it'll push it down a little more. Right. And we had to sand this, didn't we? Yes. Because it was just a little bit too snug. Uh -huh, and the parachute would not come out, so when it was landing, it would break this. It would break the fin and we wouldn't be able to launch it again. That's right. Alright, I'll get the parachute all set. Looking down on our launch field from the eye in the sky cam, this view should give us a unique look at our Esther's baby birthday launch. So the wind is blowing this way right now, as you can see. So we are getting our launch, our rocket already. So then we are gonna put it on our launch pad and, the, and we'll probably be all go for launch. We need to make sure we're clear of all airplanes right now. We have an airplane going over us right now. So we'll need to wait for the rocket launch until he is all gone. Ryan's setting up the camera here, the view camera. The baby Bertha. Baby Bertha launch. All right, Let's go back to the launch station. Ready? Alright, press it down. Hold that down. Hold on, watch the rocket. Watch the rocket. Alright. Three, two, one. So what happened? Why the failure to launch? It had to do with the model rocket starter that I inserted into the engine. These starters are fragile, and when I pushed it in, the thin metal broke instead of perforating the solid rocket fuel. When I replaced the starter, I was more careful and could actually feel the starter push into the engine. The drone angle isn't as good as we thought it would be. We might try getting a little closer next time. We're back from our launch. <laughs> so here is baby Bertha. She, for some reason, they did not go as high as we thought. You think it was the winds? Maybe. The winds were stronger. Yeah, the winds were stronger. So at least the 10 weather. knots, maybe 12 knots of wind. Yeah. And maybe our launch pad that we customized. Yeah. Um, our wooden launch pad that we needed to drill a hole in because it was not working as well as we thought. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we're new at this. It's our first rocket. Yeah. So we learned about the starters. I yeah. pushed one in too hard and it didn't make connection with the rocket fuel. Yeah. 
So we had our false launch there. Yes. Well, we fixed that, didn't we? Um, I accidentally launched it at five. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna launch our rockets at five now instead of during our countdown. Yeah. That was funny. And our parachute was slow to deploy. That had us worried, but it did. So I don't know if that was how I wrapped yeah, like, it. I don't think that was how you wrapped it. Like I, I think it was kind of like the wind. It was blowing it too hard, and that's why it. It couldn't really open up, maybe. Uh -huh. Yep. The wind pressure blowing on it because it went going pressure. that way and it's coming up, it's kind right. of hard to get up. But it was fun, wasn't it? Uh-huh. It's it good. Here is our successful successful landing rocket right That's here. That's right, we it's saved her so we can launch it again. Pressure. So what are we going to launch next? We are going to launch this rocket. What's that one it called? It is the Gross Fire IX. ISX. Crossfire ISX. And it says this one goes to 1100 feet. And if uh, the baby birth is any indication, we hope to get about 300 feet out of it. We will see. And um, maybe our next video will talk more about the engine, the rocket power. Mm -hmm. So we can learn about that. Yes. Okay? Yes. And th we will probably be, be building this next week or either this week or next week. So our next video will probably be around... In a couple weeks. In a couple weeks. Okay. Thanks for watching. Hope you learned something. Bye.